Hello, once again, nandito tayo sa napakagandang farm ng mga corn, ng corn farm ito. So, gusto naming mag-share ulit ngayon. Ay, of course, uh, gusto pala namin kayong pasalamatan sa aming mga new followers. Yeah, just this week, we have uh, another 1,000 new followers. Yes, imagine that. Maraming so maraming much. salamat po. For the Parang Far Arts po. Maraming salamat for continuously liking, sharing. viewing, and sharing. Yes. So, maraming maraming salamat po talaga. We are so happy sa support po ninyo. And for more videos like this, please continue to watch and share it pa sa mga friends po natin. Alright? Yes. So, right now, uh, gusto namin i-share sa inyo yung ways or, or style of parenting. We have discussed this two years ago, I think. And sa, sa aming mga new followers, we hope that you can uh, learn from uh, this uh, discussion uh, at this moment. So, yeah. yung... Merong famous na psychologist whose name is Diana Bomrin. Yes. Na, na nag-identify na meron pa lang four main types of parenting styles. Yes, yes. Sa kanyang research. <laughs> yes. According to his, her research. Yes. So, siya yung pinakakilala when it comes to when it comes to study about family sa so yung psychological or psychologists regarding dito. So, ang first na diniscuss niya ay yung authoritarian parenting. Yeah. Itong style na to kasi is characterized by strict rules mm -hmm. or high expectations. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Little to no flexibility. Mm -hmm. Yung mga parents po na nag adapt ng style na to, authoritarian, authoritarian style, yeah tend to have high control over their children. Yeah. Pero may lack warmth and emotional support. Yes. So uh, if we are if we think na authoritarian tayo then at least we need to evaluate. At things. least we can identify <laughs> yes, yeah, yes. ours. Well, sometimes style. <laughs> sometimes we don't know, right? Sometimes yeah, we don't know. Tayo. I think um hindi naman lahat ng Filipino uh, Filipino parents but sometimes we, uh, na, we tend to we be tend authoritarian. To be. Yes, yeah. yes, yes. So, yung pangalawa ay yung tinatawag na yep. permissive parenting. Alright? Yeah, permissive parenting. Uh, very indulgent and lenient naman ito sa mga anak nila. May mga konting rules and uh, inaalaw nila yung mga anak nila na kung ano yung uh, gusto nilang gawin. Uh, pwede rin silang mag-provide ng warmth and emotional support pero ito yung mga nag-struggle na nag-set ng boundaries at ma-enforce yung discipline ito yung mga parents na yun permissive parenting alright so the next one ay yung authoritative parenting okay yung style naman nito is often considered the most balanced and effective authoritative oh. kasi uh, yung mga parents na ganito, they set clear rules and expectations sa mga anak nila. And at the same time, they provide warmth, support, and open communication. Kaya yung mga anak nila ay uh, uh, mas, ano yun, mas responsive sila sa mga anak nila at sa mga needs nila. And they can provide guidance at discipline sa nurturing I na pamamaraan. Based sa experience natin, uh, karamihan ng mga western parent parents na parents no uh, they they are like this yeah. yeah yeah not all pero may mga friends kami na they are uh, uh, this is their style of parenting yes okay. so yung last one yung uninvolved parenting yes yung mga uninvolved very obvious naman sa name di ba na they are neglectful and show little interest or involvement sa mga anak nila sa buhay ng mga anak nila kasi uh, they provide very minimal emotional support minimal guidance and supervision itong yeah. style na to can have negative effects sa development ng mga bata sa bata. sa well-being nila kasi uh, napakahalaga po fellow parents na uh, we actually yung intentional parenting yes, yes. So, maybe because uh, yun yung the way that we were taught or yes. the experience natin sa environment natin or maybe because we are really too busy yung mga magulang kaya wala na tayong time sa ating mga anak kaya uh, nagpo-fall tayo sa ganitong style of parenting yeah pero according to this uh, psychologist you know, si Diana sinabi niya naman now parents may also adopt different styles depending yes. on the situation 
or their child's needs. Kasi mas kilala ng mga parents nga naman yung mga anak nila. So, each parenting style dito na nabanggit natin yung authoritarian parenting, permissive parenting, authoritative parenting, and uninvolved parenting. Itong mga style na to can have different effects naman on children's yes. behavior, yes. sa self-esteem nila, at saka sa overall development yes. nila. Meron na uh effective itong style of parenting sa iba, itong iba mm. naman na hindi effective, or uh, we should say na uh, sa, sa culture din sometimes yes, iba sometimes sa, culture, sa culture kung saan tayo pinalaki, ano yung uh, well sa Philippines kasi sometimes uh, may pagka authoritarian or authoritative din but ang kagandahan nga ngayon we are learning so many things dahil ma marami ng mga trainings online, right? Yes. Yun yung kagandahan, may mga kasi dati smart ang, parenting. I, I yeah, like smart that. smart parenting. Kasi yes. dati ang, uh, ang naririnig natin, wala naman tayong uh, manual for parenting yeah. when we started uh, to have our own family, di ba? Our yeah. children. Pero marami ng mga resources ngayon. Actually, we love Chinkita and, and his wife. Happy wife, happy yeah, life. Yeah. <laughs> si Ma'am Novian and also... Other mentors. Yeah. Um, yeah. Teach with Joy. Teach yeah? with Joy. Joy yeah. Mendoza and yeah. Eric Mendoza. Yeah. 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 Yes, may so, mga resources yes. online, mga mentors, that coaches. Team, that team Kramer family, right? Yeah, okay we, we, din po sila. Yeah. So, marami, marami tayong matututunan sa mga content creators ng mga families that they are really doing great right now. Kaya, um, uh, we don't, if we really want to have a wonderful uh, time with our children that if we really want to learn I think I think kailangan din natin mag sacrifice to search lalo na hindi na hindi na mahirap ngayon maraming opportunities online to research so uh, yan lamang po for today so maraming salamat po and we love everyone so we want to learn from you and we want to share with you yung experience din namin by continuously doing this uh, mga vlog po namin Okay, so yeah, don't forget to join our Facebook community so we can strengthen each other and share some tips and our thoughts, our experiences. Yeah. Yes. So thank you for bye.